How to Ruin a Relationship with Modern Technology by Cherokee Billy As a psychic advisor, the majority of my calls are from people with problems in their love life. What I have, ob have observed that is ruining relationships is modern technology. Nowadays, people use text messaging, Facebook, MySpace, and email as ways of communicating with someone that they are in a relationship with or trying to have a relationship with. Let me explain to you that this is not real communication. The dictionary defines communication as the following, the act of communicating, transmission, the exchange of thoughts, messages, or information as by speech, signals, writing, Texting is not writing or behavior. Interpersonal rapport. The art and technique of using words effectively to impart information or ideas. True communication is face to face or by telephone where you can hear the tone and pick up the vibration of what this person is feeling towards you. It's impossible to understand what someone is meaning if it's a joke or if it's something serious with a few simple text messages back and forth. I have clients call me with frantic questions such as I texted him slash her 20 minutes ago and he slash she hasn't responded back. What is he slash she thinking about me? Is he she mad at me? What does this mean? Why doesn't he she respond? I tell them it's easy. Call and find out or go and see him or her. Relationships and marriages are falling apart faster than the economy. The main reason is people are not having proper communication. The art of communication is being lost because of the modern methods of communication or should I say lack of communication. I don't understand why someone cannot take a few minutes to pick up the phone and call and get a direct answer rather than agonize for hours before someone responds to their text or email message. It doesn't make sense. Yet every day as a psychic advisor I hear the same questions over and over from different people. My advice is always the same. If you want to ruin the relationship or potential relationship continue using text message. It's a surefire way to end a new relationship or destroy a relationship that has been going for a few years. When people go to business meetings, luncheons, or dinners, many times they are texting, texting messages under the table. They are texting when they drive their cars, when they're walking down the street, in a hospital, or even in a movie theater. This has gone way too far. It's evident that our society is falling apart in so many different areas and communi communication is probably the biggest one. It's difficult to get people to read. I often send written advice to a client after our phone call and they will tell me they never read what I sent. When I ask why, they reply with, well, I just don't have time. If you have can find the time to brush your teeth, have a meal, or watch television, you have time to read. No matter how busy you may think you are, you must find time for reading or surrender yourself to self-chosen ignorance. As long as you continue communicating in these methods, you can be guaranteed that you will not have a successful relationship. My advice is if you want to relearn to ruin a relationship, keep texting. You can reach me, Cherokee Billy, at www.cherokeebilly.com.